Hey everybody, it's Nina again and I've decided that I will do a part two of my Catrice recommendations and favourites because I just love Catrice. And I think if you can get your hands on them, on this on this um brand, go ahead and do so because you are not going to regret spending your money on this. And it's not even, not one item is over 10 euro. It's just amazing and I really highly recommend these. So I'm going to talk about the limited edition um, Baroque Glamour that's still available in my uh, local pharmacy, Lynch's Chemists or Lynch's Pharmacy. Um, if you don't already have them, I recommend that you actually go and try and get them because it once you once they've run out, you're not going to get them again. So I'm going to talk about the four favorite eyeshadows that I just find absolutely amazing and for the for the price. I think they're either they're definitely under five euro anyway they're just amazing so they look like these that the baroque glamour this one is in beige velvet i have all four eyeshadows and this is what it looks like i don't know whether you can actually see this now or not i'm sorry if you can't this is what it looks like i hope you can see it it's kind of a goldy toned beautiful highlight shade um perfect for inside the eye to waken your eyes up i use it all the time to do that because i do have super black rings under my eyes and just to open up my eyes it's just amazing it's beautiful for underneath your brow as well Um, i don't know whether the swatch is going to come out properly here or not but i do have swatches on my facebook page so if you want to have a look go ahead Um, i will put the link down below anyway that there it is there i'm not sure whether you can actually see that or not it's such a light shade beautiful highlight shade the next shade i'm going to talk about is the luscious green i absolutely love this shade perfect for my um eye color that's what it looks like there beautiful beautiful mossy green with golden um sparkle to it and golden undertone to it not much sparkle i have to admit myself seriously highly pigmented you only need the slightest little bit and this is it here one thing about it about them are the just a little bit powdery but not much and that's it there look at the sheen on it it's beautiful i don't know if you can see that or not as i said i have swatches on my facebook page the next one is purple silk this is my utmost favorite too because it just makes my green eyes pop as well and this is it here a little bit of shimmer to it beautiful for go wearing on a night out as you can see highly pigmented absolutely fantastic it's a pity that they didn't make these in more colors because i would have them on definitely and that's what it looks like i don't know if you can actually see that now or not this one here beautiful and last but not least is the opulent 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 uh, brown <laughs> I really can't pronounce my words these days and this is it here beautiful brown shade i'd wear this on my on its own but even if that there's a kind of a slight um purpley it's kind of a purpley mauvey brown this is it here it's beautiful again highly pigmented but gorgeous that's it there so that is the eyeshadows and I am going to show you two of the Baroque Glamour um, nail polishes that are absolutely incredible. This one here is called Purple Silk and this one here is called Scottish Red. Look at those shades. Absolutely amazing. Beautiful, beautiful shades. I also have these up on my Facebook page, so have a, you can have a look. And last but not least in the Baroque Glamour is my favourite um, lipsticks. They come like this. Really posh, I have to say, for the price that you're paying. And again, I think they're under €5. Euro. And they're in shades of opulent brown again. And golden brown. So I'll do a swatch of these. Look, this is the golden brown beautiful beautiful and this is the swatch of it very sheer i have to say and this one's quite light and it's a perfect everyday natural um lipstick 
and that's it there beautiful and the next one is the appellant blood brown <laughs> really and this one that's what it looks like it's quite dark very very sheer they're both very sheer but yet again there's nice bit of pigmentation in that one this one's here beautiful on now there's another lipstick that I like I actually had two but I don't know where my other one has gone I think I probably have it in one of my purses um, this one is the Ultimate Shine Fox Knox. Looks like this. And this is the shade. Beautiful. I have it on. Mm -hmm. Lovely sheen to it. And I'll do a swatch of it. So creamy. Oh, beautiful. And that's what it looks like. Swatched. And that's what it looks like on my lip. See? Beautiful. They are fantastic. And they last for like a good two, three hours before you even have to reapply again. Um, next is the Catrice All Round Mascara. It's the waterproof mascara. It says that it gives extra volume, length and curl. This is what it looks like. Now... The only fault I find with this is that it doesn't give extra volume. It gives the extra length and it, it gives the lovely curl, but it doesn't give the volume. To me, it doesn't anyway. And this is what the brush looks like. But it is amazing and it gets to every lash that you have. It's absolutely incredible. And it, it's brilliant on the bottom lashes as well. Um, I'm going to show you, I have these I just don't want uh, the video running out these are the lip glosses that I have some of them are the lip appeal and some of them are color show now I don't really find a difference to be honest with you in them some of them have got glitter in them and some of them have got some of them are a lot more pigmented than others so I will show you the I'll show you one color one lip appeal and one color show just to kind of shorten the video a bit. So this is the lip appeal one. And it looks like this. And this one is in very, very, very nice. And you're getting the brush like this. Brush is fantastic. I love the brush. And this is what this one looks like. As you can see, they're highly pigmented. Any of the color, any of the color show ones are, or the lip appeal one, sorry, get mixed up with the two of them. This is the lip appeal one that I'm after swatching and it's very pigmented. And this one is the color show one. Now to me, it don't really find much in the difference. And this one is number nine, be mine. Yeah, that's what it looks like. And I will do a swatch on that too. Like they're both very pigmented. So to be, I don't see why there's a difference in the name, but there you go. Absolutely fantastic. All these lip glosses are amazing. And they kind of smell a little bit sweet, not overly sweet, but they don't they kind of wear off after a while. They actually remind me of the Nyx's um, lip glosses. So that is it, girls. As I said, if you have any questions, just don't hesitate to ask. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any more requests just let me know if you want to see any of these swatched or whatever just like click on the link below I will put it to my Facebook um, Catrice album so until next time I shall talk to you soon bye